it to start off immediately so that we don't take much of your time okay so thank you for joining us for those that have joined us good morning good afternoon good evening wherever you are in the world um my name is jacinta a premium realtor here in lagos um priority is always to make sure that you get value for your money by investing in real estate easily so today without taking much of your time today's topic are the real estate talk with jacinta the episode six of real estate talk with jacinta is centered on our first time real estate investors now today's topic is five actions first time real estate investors must take before you get into investing in real estate so we know that real estate investing is a wealth booster and it's so interesting if you want to invest there because it makes you become wealthy however it can also be overwhelming to some people especially to those to our first time real estate investors what i mean by first time real estate investors are people that want to get or want to invest into real estate they are first time real estate investors sometimes you hear first time home buyers sometimes you hear first time uh, land owners so sometimes it uh it gets to it's oh sometimes overwhelming to them like someone called me um last week thereabouts was like ah i've not invested in real estate before and i want to see if i can get at least let me start with land how will i go about it and the properties i see online is just too much i don't even know where to start from i don't even know what to do so i had to tell her what to do you know tell her the process that this is what you need to do and cool so it got it got me thinking i was like okay let me just do a live video to also let people to get people informed especially the first time home buyers or first time real estate investors so that they will know the process they will know what to do the actions they have to take you know most times when i talk i'll be like have you achieved your 2022 real estate goals if you've not take the necessary actions and some will be asking what is these necessary actions you'll be always be saying take actions take steps take necessary actions and go so today i decided to pull out five actions that you need to take as a first-time home buyer or first-time real estate investors so that you invest rightly so when it comes to real estate investing thank you for joining me when it comes to real estate investing it evolves around three w's and one h now these three w's are why what where and how now why do you want to invest in real estate as a first time investor why do you want to invest why do you want to go into real estate why do you want as a what made you say okay i want to i want uh, to have a real estate i want to own properties this year why you need to know your why two why what what kind of real estate what type of real estate would you want to own or would you want to invest in like i said this three w's evolves in what it evolves when it comes to investing in real estate now where do you want to own that property where do you want to invest in real estate and how do you want to go about it how do you want to invest in real estate so this for first time investors or for those that want to invest in real estate these are the questions you need to ask yourself before you put in your money or before you invest in any property. You need to be informed. You need to know what you want to invest in before you go into it. So, that being said, we will dive straight to the actions that you need to take as a first-time investor. So, if you want to go into real estate as a first-time investor, 
or you've invested and it's been a long time you invested sorry and you want to go into investing or you want to invest in real estate please take this ashes i said that five ashes that you need to take the first one is start saving you need to start saving even if you're not ready to buy today or you're not ready to invest tomorrow as far as you've already written it in your goals that you want to invest in real estate or you want to own properties before the end of this year or before the second quarter of next year you need to start saving towards it because you don't even know when the right deal or when the right property will just come so you need to start saving because the right property can come like next month and like i said most of our properties come uh with flexible payment plan so you need to start saving so that you can you'll be able to make the down payment so if you want to invest in real estate the first thing is you need to start saving no matter even if you are not ready to invest in real estate you need to start saving for it and this involves in why you want to invest in real estate and when you are saving please don't let your emotions play with you don't let it play with you investing in real estate is serious business because you are investing to make money so you don't need to, you don't need to let your emotion you don't need to put your emotions first if you know you want to invest in real estate and you've put it down that okay this is what you want to do you want to invest in real estate at first you need to start saving first you need to start saving okay let me start putting this money little by little start saving it in one account till i find out the kind of real estate or the type of real estate i want to invest in that's the first thing you need to do now the second thing you need to do is to educate yourself gone are those days that you, uh, when you want to put in money you just bring out money and put in money without knowing what that investment is all about a lot of people have made that mistake putting in money in what they don't even know about so you need to educate yourself you want to go into real estate you want to invest in you want to invest in real estate you need to know more about real estate you need to start reading books you need to make your research you need to know how to get um good deals you need to know about the land titles we have in lagos or in nigeria as a whole you need to know the land titles you need to know where it's free and where it's committed you need to know the government acquisition you need to know you know you need to learn more about real estate so that it will help you make informed decision it will help you make informed decision in fact Internet has made it more easier for us that you can even do your research online at the tip of your finger. Just type how to invest in real estate or, uh, or things to know before investing in real estate. As a matter of fact, in my, uh, I think, episode one or two or three, I've spoken about six things to consider before investing in real estate. I've also uh, uh, talk, uh, spoken about how to know your land titles. I've spoken about types of houses or types of properties. So if you've not um, watched it or you've not gone through it, thank you for joining me. If you've not gone through it, please go to my YouTube at Genic Properties. Genic Properties. J-A-N-I-C-K -I Properties. There you will see real estate talk with jacinta i've spoken about how to get huge return on investment how to get you return on investment three things three ways to get huge return on investment i've spoken about that i've spoken about land title so these are things you need to do if you want to invest in real estate you need to educate yourself you need to make your research you need to read you need to watch videos on how to invest on on um the titles of the land on how to get good deals on how to make huge return on investment you need to educate yourself so as to 
um, make informed decision and don't forget when you are on my youtube also subscribe at jenny properties and also turn on your bell notification so that you don't miss out on any of our videos in our youtube so that's the second thing you need to, to you need to do thank you for those that just joined me i was talking about actions you need to take before actions you need to take you must take as a first time investor as a first time real estate investors there are some actions you need to take so that you invest rightly and the first thing i said was you need to start saving even if you've not seen that property or you've not you're not ready to invest in that property you need to start saving because that right property can come at any time so you need to start saving and the second thing i talked about is you need to educate yourself gone are those days you put your money in what you don't know you need to educate yourself you need to know the kind of property you're going into you need to know your the 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 location you need to know everything about real estate you need to know you need to know even if you don't want to know everything at least you should know the title you should know how to get how to get good deals you should know all those things because they are on on the internet and before i talked about um the actions i said that when it comes to real estate there are three w's and one h that evolves around real estate why what where and how why do you want to invest where do you what kind of property type of property you want to invest in where do you want to invest what locations do you want to invest in and how do you want to invest in it so that's where we are so thank you for joining me for those that have just joined us now so the third thing action you need to take is to analyze the property do your research on property this evolves around what type of property you want to invest in do your research about properties in a particular location what kind of property performs well in a particular location what i mean by performs well that gives you high return on investment like if you want to okay you 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 want to go into short led business what type of property performs well in short leg business like for instance in ikate lekki the type of property that performs well when it comes to short leg business is two bedroom uh, apartment it performs very well so you need to analyze those property if you want to go into um um, um houses what uh, what do you want to use the houses to do you want to buy and um sell or you want to buy and rent it out or you want to use it for short legs you need to know what you want to do then you now analyze the kind of property you that you want to that you have to invest in that will help in what you want to do on why you want to invest in that real estate so if you've known why you want to invest in real estate then you need to know the type of property that will conform to your why you need to know that if you want to go into land for those that are in lagos because i'm a lagos realtor a premium realtor for that matter and you want to <coughs> go into lands you need to know the kind of estates the kind of locations that are doing well when it comes to lagos we have locations that are performing beautifully well we have locations that are trending we have locations that when you put in your money within 12 months you can get over 100 percent return on investments there are locations like that locations like uh the emerging locations like ibejileki ekpe ekpe is the location ekpe is is now the location that is trending it's now locations that you will see acres of land where you can buy at affordable price and sell at higher price and it's a location that people are already moving into getting properties so these are things you need to watch out for and when you want to uh, go into estates or you want to buy into land you need to confirm you need to know the kind of features that is coming with that estate because these are also th uh, things that will also make the property appreciate. Because our main priority is to make sure that you get 
properties that make sure that you get value for your money so when you invest in, in real estate or in a property that doesn't give you that appreciation rate that you want you won't be happy with your investment so you need to analyze that property since you've known your why thank you for joining me for those that join me now thank you for joining me since you've known your why you've started saving saving for that property you want to you've known your why and you started saving for that property and you've had you you've done your research you've done your research about the property you want to go about the location or about the title or about uh, about anything real estate how you can go into real estate how you can get huge returns then you need to analyze that property you need to anal analyze the property you want to go into it is very very important especially if you are a first time real estate investor so the first one i talked about is you need to start saving because you don't know when the right deal will come uh, come your way the second thing you need to, you you educate yourself educate yourself gone are those days you put your money in a business you don't know or in an investment you don't know educate yourself then the third thing is analyze the property analyze the property you want to go into if you want to go into short light analyze what type of property performs well for short lead business it's not every property that performs well for short lead business so you need to analyze that if you want to go into lands you need to find out the estate that has good features that is strategically located not just invest anyhow so these are these these are the first three things you need to actions you need to take then the fourth one after you've saved you've educated yourself you've analyzed your property then you find your crystal clear criteria now what i mean by that is after you've analyzed the property then you you now have an idea of the location you want to invest in of the type of property you want to invest in so this evolves around where now you now narrow down okay that's uh okay if i want to go into short lead business so i think the best location i need to go into is ikate and the type of property i need to look for or i need to invest in is a two-bedroom apartment now you've narrowed down your search it makes it easier for you you will no longer be overwhelmed by the thousands of property that you see online then if you now want to go into lands you want to invest into lands you don't want to buy and build. You want to invest in a land that will that you will keep for some time before you sell. Then you now look at the location that is doing well. Okay, you've seen the location. Oh, Ekpe is now this the is the estate. Uh, Ekpe is the location that is now um uh, trending that people are now going into. Okay, ah, then let me go to Ekpe. That this is what. Uh, okay, ah, and this is the kind of future I want. I want a, an estate that will give me that innovative lifestyle that promotes innovate uh, uh, technology or that provo uh, it promotes lifestyle. Then I will now pick the uh properties or the land thank you for joining me i will not pick the lands that suits my taste that suits that lifestyle that i want now you've narrowed it down so when you now want to invest in real estate and you go online you will not be confused because you've already done your savings uh, you've done the uh, actions that you're supposed to take you say you start saving You've educated yourself. Uh, you've analyzed the property that you want, and now you've narrowed it down. You've written this is the uh, location I want to invest in. This is the type of property that is doing well in that location. So this is the property type of property I will go into. Then this is the kind of futures I want, and I will look for the estate or the land that has that kind of futures. It makes it easier for you. And you will not be overwhelmed with the lots and lots of properties that you see online. So, for those that join me, 
uh, um, I'm actually talking about uh, this real estate talk with Jacinta and today's episode is episode 6 and today's episode is centered on first time um, real estate investors and we've talked uh, uh, about the first four actions you need to take and before we talked about it we um, I said that when it comes to real estate investing that three W's and one H that evolves around real estate investing why are you why do you want to invest what type of property do you want to invest in where do you want to invest in and how do you want to invest in so this evolves around get you getting into or you investing in real estate so the actions now you need to take the first one i spoke about is you need to start saving you need to start saving even if you want to invest maybe you've written it down in your goals now that means that means you've made up your mind that you want to invest in real estate you need to start saving and don't let your emotions play with you when once you know that yes so that you want to start saving you want to invest in real estate your emotions to be it should be out of place it should be out of it pull it in because you know you are going into business you are going into real estate or you are investing in real estate to make money then after that you need to educate yourself after that you need to analyze the property you want to uh, invest in then you now narrow down you now find the crystal clear criteria you narrow down the property the location you want to invest in the type of property that is performing well you narrow it down then after doing these first four actions after taking the first four actions the fifth one is you get a realtor you get a realtor you find a realtor that understands your needs that on the on that understands what you want to invest in that understand the kind of property you want to invest in where you want to invest in that understands your why that understands your what that understands your where and that's and and, and that's that your why your what and your where you need to find the a router that understands those three things that understands your why your what and your where this is why we are journey properties we are always there to help you to guide you through to invest rightly so please gone are those days that you just go and invest in real estate without an expert you need a router if you don't have a router as a first-time investor please get one we are here for you at Jenny properties within the just a call away i will help you will guide you through so that you invest rightly so i said that uh, we have uh, five actions first you need to start saving Thank you for joining me. Thank you for joining me. The second one, you educate yourself. The third one, you analyze the property. The fourth one, you find a crystal clear criteria. And the fifth one, you get a rotten. Now a bonus for you. I have to give you the sixth one as a bonus. Go for site inspection or home viewing. If you know you want land, go for site inspection after you've done this first five you've gotten that router please go for site inspection you can do it physically you can do it virtually technology has made it very easy for you distance is not a barrier even if you want you shall want someone to go for that inspection and you're not in the country send a proxy the person will will go with the router for the inspection why is site inspection or home viewing very important it is very important so that you as the first time investor will make an informed decision you will not just make decision on what the router tells you you will see it with your two eyes virtually or physically so even if you are outside the country it is not a barrier you can book for virtual tour and when i when i mean virtual tour they will the virtual tour 
will sh will show you even the environment where um uh, where the um uh, from the express road or to where the property is then if you are coming physically it is also very wonderful or you're sending someone the thing is just for you to make an informed decision so that you don't regret the investment that probably or you don't regret investing the property that probably you didn't you don't want so please as a first time investor this is the i'll call it six actions you need to take so if i'm going to recap i said that when it comes to real estate investment it evolves around three w's and one h why do you want to invest what type of property do you want to invest in where do you want to invest in that's the location where do you want to invest in and how do you want to invest in first actions you need to take is first and foremost you need to start saving whether you're not ready to, even if you're not ready to invest now you need to start saving because i know you invest tomorrow i know you invest in, uh, next month you need to start saving then you need to educate yourself you need to educate yourself you need to analyze the properties analyze the properties you see a lot of properties online you need to analyze them then you narrow those properties down you narrow it down to the criteria to what you want to your why you narrow it down what location the property that is performing well in that location um, and what kind of features am i expecting so you narrow it down and just narrow down the few properties that you you you'll be interested in then you get a realtor that understands your why your what and your where after that please go for site inspection so this is just the um six actions you need to take for as an as a first time investor so that you make the an informed decision and you invest rightly so thank you for joining me um you guys are much thank you for joining me whoa wow 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 thank you for joining me i may not be able to call all your names but thank you for joining me and i hope you learned something today so if you have any question please you can quickly ask me now you can ask me now if you have any questions you can ask me now any question as regards to real estate invest investing how to go about it you can ask me now and if as let's say, as a first time investor you can also go to my youtube at jenny properties i've spoken about six things to consider before investing in real estate i've spoken about um land titles how to know your land titles I've spoken about that. I've also spoken about um, ways to get huge returns. You know, that one is very, very important. Ways to get huge, huge returns in real estate. I've spoken about that. I've also spoken about house types. Please go watch them. Go learn. Go make your research before you invest in real estate. So do we have any other questions? So for more inquiries about real estate investment, please... Do call us on 090-1259-4511. We'll be there to help you so that you make you make the right, uh, so that you invest rightly. So thank you for joining me. For those that joined me, thank you. And sorry, apologies to those that joined before. The network actually affected us, but we thank God we came back to life. So thank you for joining me. Thank you. Thank you so much. So, till I come your way next time, keep investing. Not just investing, keep investing rightly. Bye.